cocina. Uh -huh. Tiene apenas tres meses, ha sido um, entregada por una persona de Cocha de Santa Cruz. Se llama Tina Tortu. Tina, okay. Tina Torturadora. Porque cinco veces en la noche se despierta, me muerde para que yo le dé su leche. Entonces no me deja dormir, me tortura. <risa> ya, nena, nena. Y esta es su abuela, nena. <risa> nena, pucha. No es para ti, nena. Tú ya eres vieja. Nena. <risa> monkey's tongue in your face. Market. Market, 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 market. Monkey ya vive en total libertad. Eh, él solo viene de visita de vez en cuando a, a visitarnos acá al refugio. Él es nocturno. ¿Ve? I think it was uh, caught originally when he was four months old in the hills of Chile and then uh, taken into the circus in Cochabamba where he did, was uh, tied to a stake there and I believe he had both his back legs busted. Um, from there Juan Carlos, the guy that runs into Wariasi in the refuge and is the only guy in Bolivia that has say, the status of an RSPCA person went into the, uh, went into the circus and took him from there and reintroduced him here. I think when he was maybe... How old is he now? Two years? Now he's two years old. But he was brought here like eight months old. When he was eight months old? Yeah. As you can see, he's connected to a lead, which is then connected to a run or a hook. At the moment, he's on pretty high ground because the rains have uh, moved the level of the river up. And uh, his beach, where he normally used to run around on, is flooded at present. Normally it's about a two or three hundred yard run with two pools of water each at each end. <laughs> 